In the figure below, square ABCD is circumscribed about circle O. If square ABCD is sides of length 4, what is the area of the shaded region? Now, later on, we're going to make sure that students remember how to solve directly for the area of a shaded region. But right here, we want to illustrate a different point. It's that guesstimate can help students get rid of answer choices that are absolutely impossible. Let's take a look at what we've got in front of us with our picture. We know that we've got a square with sides of length 4. That means that the entire square has got to be 16. If we're looking for the area of the shaded region, we've got to be looking for something that's a lot less than 16. If we take a look at our answer choices and we put in something for pi about 3, take a look at answer choice A. Answer choice A was 4 minus 2 pi, which means it's 4 minus 6 roughly, which is negative 2. Negative 2? Can the shaded region be negative 2? No, that would be impossible. So if that's going to be impossible, A is out. What about B? B was 4 minus 4 pi. Well, if we put in 3 for pi again, 4 minus 12 is negative 8. Negative 8! There is no way that A or B is possible for the area of the shaded region because they are negative values. Take a look at answer choice E. 16 minus 16 pi. Well, that's 16 minus 16 times about 3. That's negative 32. Negative 32, negative 8, negative 2, they're both gone. Right away, we could be down to C and D. If we had to try and think to ourselves what's possible for the shaded region, we should be looking for something that's a lot less than 16. Our two answer choices, C and D, one is 10, the other is 4. Which one's a lot less than 16? Certainly, this is less than half of the square. That means the only reasonable answer for us to actually get here is D. Guesstimate helps eliminate answer choices that are completely impossible and helps us get down to a rough approximation that makes this question one that is going to be solved easily by students, even those that forget how to solve directly for a shaded area.